Hi everybody, this is Tina. Welcome back to my channel. So I have some project shares, um, some cards that I did I want to share with you guys. So before I get started, I'll just share some of the products that I used um, in creating the cards. So uh, first of all, I used uh, mostly uh, paper from the Bow Bunny Secret Garden collection that I got at Tuesday morning. I did use a couple of the smaller pieces as well. And then I used um, some paper out of um, this stack. This is a hot buy from uh, Michael's a long time ago. It's by Crate Paper, and it's called, um, let's see, does it have a name? It doesn't say. It says Paper Pad, Crate Paper, Crate Paper. Yeah, it doesn't have a, it doesn't have a name. But um, this is what it looks like, and I did use some of the Cherry Blossom Paper, um, a couple of other different papers from this um, paper stack. So those are the papers that I used. Um, I did use La La Land uh, kimo Kimonio. How do you say it? Kimono. Kimono? I don't know, you guys. <laughs> Kimono Marcy. And uh, so I used her on one of my cards. She's super cute. And then I used these... Um, Geisha girls from CC Design. These girls here. I've had this stamp set for a very long time and I decided to pull it out and use it. Um, and then I did use a few elements from this um, stamp set that I got at a yard sale. Um, this is one of those ones that come in the magazine card making. It was a freebie that comes in the, in the card kit. Well, um, I used the lantern and I used some of the bamboo off of this uh, stamp set. Okay. And then um, I used, of course, uh, my stitched rectangles from Gina Marie. I used um, a thank you word die from this set here. This, I believe this was AliExpress. Um, I used these panda stickers that I got from my friend Gigi. Here on YouTube and I also used a few of these uh, glittery enamel dots from CC designs okay and sorry about that glare from that window gosh I need to get some new curtains for this window so I can block that glare um, all right so this was the first card that I made and this was with that La La Land stamp uh, the Marcy stamp that I shared with you I thought it came out really nice. I had the cherry blossom paper in the background. Then I layered a pink and gold doily up here. This was from Michaels. And then I took a piece of white cardstock and I used a Martha Stewart punch and I punched both ends. So um, if you can see that right there, I have that on the top and some at the bottom. And that goes underneath. And then um, this stamp was in there and it's um hello in hawaii i looked it up in um uh, i think it's like in japan not hawaii uh yeah but anyway this word says hello um and then here we have the marcy color with copics um i paper pieced her her uh kimono her gown there i paper pieced that and then this um cherry blossom stem is a hard 3D, it's very um, dimensional, and that was a Jolie's, um, and I put that there um, at the bottom of the card. And then this was the little um, Japanese plant there that was in the stamp set. Okay, and then here is the inside. So I love the way that card came out. Um, I had a lot of fun coloring it and making that. Um, I haven't used that stamp in a long time, so I was glad to take that out. Okay, and these are the cards that I made with the CC Designs. So um, I used a different cherry blossom paper in the background. I used my stitch rectangles to make this layer here. And this is like an off-white. This paper was actually in the Secret Garden collection as well. Um, and then colored the image with Copics. Here are those little glittery dots from CC Designs. And then here were the elements that I used off of that um, 
that other stamp set um, that came in the magazine. I used the bamboo and then the cherry blossom tree branch and the lantern. And then here's that little panda stamp uh, sticker from that sticker set from Gigi. So super, super cute. I had so much fun creating these cards and there's the inside. I just put another little panda and a little heart and decorated with the cherry blossom paper. So that was that card. And then here's another one that I made with the other, one of the other, there were three of these little girls. So um, this was the other one. And this one I did, um, I did her hair blue underneath. Now I'm not sure the camera's picking that up. There's a blue tinge underneath and then there's black over the top. And then I put some glitter uh, sparkly pen on it. So um, can you see their hair is blue underneath? Really cute. I used a very light color skin color because um, I looked these girls up and they look like they're really pale. So I used the light skin color there. Put some uh, rosy cheeks and a little bit of red just near their eyes just to uh, enhance the eyes on that. Colored the rest with Copics. This was her gown. This one's not paper pieced. I just colored this one. Um, and then here's the bamboo again. Here's the little cherry branch with the lantern. And then I added a thank you with that thank you die that I shared. So I did that. Here's some of the little enamel dots. And there's another cute little panda. And then these stickers were in the panda sticker set. The little hearts. So that is the third card. And then here's the inside. And then I made one more with that CC Designs. Um, uh, I'm trying to keep them so you guys can see them. But I don't think that's going to happen too good. But this is the last card that I made um, with that last little girl from CC Designs. And this one I used purple underneath her hair. Now I'm not sure you can see the purple. It is glittery and there's purple underneath the black. So it gives it that um, little highlight. And... Um, then I used the pink paper uh, from, this one was actually from the, not the Secret Garden collection, the other one, the crepe paper one. And then I used the pink layer on top. This, this pink layer has a design on it. And there's that thank you again. Some enamel dots. And she's colored up with Copics. Two little hearts up here in the corner. And then this is the inside of this card. So that was the other card that I created. And that was the all four cards. And I hope you enjoyed them. I don't know if I can hold them all. But that's that one. And this one. And then this one. And then the La La Land one. So these were all the cards that I made. Um... Thank you so much for watching. Please come back for more um, inspiration and more card shares. Um, the rest of this week and to the weekend, I'll probably be using um, this kit that just came in, the La La Land. I'll be creating with this. And then also, um, I'm probably next week, I'll be getting my house mouse ready for um, April. But yeah, come back if you want to see some cards being made with that. I do have a couple other stamp sets um, that are sitting here that I wanted to use. Um, the Rooster one. Do you guys remember the Rooster stamp I bought uh, from Stampin' Up? And then I got that paper pad from um, Tuesday morning that has like chicken wire and stuff in it. So I want to do a card with this. So that's sitting here near my desk. And also I have some uh, ideas for spring cards coming up. So thank you so much again. Like I said, thank you for watching. I really appreciate each and every one of you. Please give me a thumbs up. That's always appreciated. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. And um, I hope that I can inspire you with my projects. So, okay, you guys, I'll let you go. God bless. Have a wonderful day and an awesome weekend coming up. All right, you guys. Bye.